Hey guys, so this will be my second Valentine's Day makeup tutorial. So if you'd like to see how to get this look, keep watching. I start by applying my MAC Pro Longwear Paint Pot to my lid and pretty much my entire eye area. This is in the shade Painterly. I then use the shade Chickadee from Makeup Geek and put this in and around my crease and outer corner. I'm using this as my transition color, it's like a deep yellow orange shade. I'm then using my Naked Basics palette. I'm using that lightest color, I believe it's called Virgin. And I'm using that as my brow highlight, as you can see. This is the shade Mango Tango by Makeup Geek. Sorry the lighting isn't very good. I just broke my favorite light bulb. I know that sounds weird. But, so the lighting kind of sucks for this video, but anyway, that's Mango Tango by Makeup Geek. And I'm sweeping that from my lid up to the crease. I'm also putting it in the inner corner. I really wish you could see the color because this color is so unique. It is like a peach, orange, red, I don't even know how to describe it, but if you have time, Go to MakeupGeek.com and look up the Mango Tango color. It is amazing. Next I'm taking Coco Bear, also by Makeup Geek. And I'm putting this above my crease, in my crease, and in the outer <clears throat> corner. Next I'm using my Urban Decay, I don't even know what palette that's called, it's so old. Uh, I don't have it with me right now, but I'll list it in the description box. That is the shade Last Call. It's kind of like a shimmery maroon color. Again, I'm putting this on my outer corner and kind of on like the outer half of my lid. And I'm just blending it into the Cocoa Bear and Mango Tango. Uh, the reason I wanted this look to be like the sultry and sexy look, I just want it to all smooth together so it almost looks like one color even though I've blended like four colors together. That's why I don't have any extra product on the brush right now. I'm just blending that all together so that there's just zero harsh lines. Next I'm taking that small angled brush and I believe that is the color Chickadee. I'm putting my phone on silent. So yeah, I'm taking Chickadee again, putting that on my lower lash line, and then I'm taking that round pencil brush, going back into Cocoa Bear, and I'm just going to smoke out that lower lash line even more. since I was going through for the cannot talk. But anyway, since I was going through for the sultry and sexy look, I really wanted to smoke out that bottom lash line. I'm just going back in and touching it up even more. I think I'm going to take a little bit of Oil Slick by Urban Decay, and I'm just going to put a little bit of that on the lower lash line to darken it up. And you'll see in a minute, I'm going to go back with some of that oil slick. It's like a black, shimmery black, I would say. And I'm going to put some of that in my crease and the outer corner just to make it a little bit darker. I'm taking my NYX Gel Eyeliner in Jet Black and an angled brush that I got from CVS.
Next, I'm just taking a prestige eye pencil and dipping it in that gel and tight lining my waterline. And you guys know I love my e.l.f. clear gel, so I just use that to separate my lashes. And then I use my full Buxom Full and Fabulous Mascara to finish off the look. Honestly, I think this eye look looks amazing on everyone, but the Mango Tango, I have blue colored contacts, and when I put my blue eyes in with the Mango Tango color, it is to die for. Like, if you have not seen the color Mango Tango, please go to MakeupGeek.com and check it out. It is the most unique color, I'm telling you. You will be obsessed. I think there's even a couple, if you go to like the Makeup Geek lookbook, they have a couple tutorials with it. It's really good. Uh, this is just an e.l.f. baked blush. Again, I'll list it in the description box below. I don't remember what it's called. I just wanted a really shimmery, kind of boring blush for this look because I felt like the eyes were so intense. And I'm just sweeping that on my cheek. I was really fast, but this is a Sephora lip pencil. It's their Nano lip liner. They're only $5, so go get it. And it's in the color Belly Beige, like B-E-L-L-I-E -L -L -E, Beige. I don't know. Weird. And then that's a Lipstick Queen color. Not sure of the shade. Again, I'll list both lipsticks in the description box below. Again, it's a MAC lip gloss. Not sure what shade, but I'll list everything below. I hope you enjoyed this look. Please give me comments and feedback and let me know what you want to see next. Bye, guys.